A big update has been released today for Lost Ark, which is a Korean MMO that was brought to the West last year by Amazon Games, and when it did arrive in the West, it reached the second highest number of simultaneous players in Steam history. A prominent feature in the update is the addition of the new artist class for players to use. However, Amazon revealed back in December that there would be some changes made to the class for the Western versions and explained why. In the Western 2023 roadmap, Amazon said, We know there's been a lot of speculation in the Lost Ark community on how the artist class would arrive in the western version of Lost Ark, and we want to be transparent with players excited for its release. Previously, we've stated that there may be some content in the original version of the game that gets adapted for western audiences. While our goal is to preserve the authenticity of the original game, we also work with Smilegate RPG to make localization updates to ensure the game feels approachable and representative of our western players. Nothing gameplay related will change for the artist class, but some skins will be modified to better fit western norms. Specifically, skins with short skirts will have shorts added underneath the skirt, and other skins will have adjusted pant lengths or tights added. We will be working to preserve the original spirit of these skins when applying these changes, to ensure players will have a variety of compelling customization options for this uniquely versatile class. And so from this post, Amazon has said, skins with short skirts will have shorts added underneath the skirt, and other skins will have adjusted pant lengths or tights added. Prior to the release, however, we haven't been able to see the alterations, but with today's launch, players have begun to post changes that they have discovered over on the official forum. We have now been able to see that non-paid skins will have the characters wear large bloomers, which aren't there in the original version of the game. A player has reported that it's possible to turn the bloomers off if you have other skins, although this is still something that a lot of people aren't happy with, with a player stating to quote, at least you can turn off the weird granny pants if you change some parts. Sucks though that some of the best bottoms have it. And it's not just bloomers. As Amazon previously stated, other outfits have characters wearing short shorts underneath, with this being for paid skins. The game also already has a mature rating from the ESRB and an 18 rating from Peggy. As the class has only just been released, and with there being a lot of content, it's possible that there will be more differences spotted in the future. Plus, with the game being regularly updated, future content may have new differences as well. These are also not the only western changes Amazon has made to Lost Ark since the game's launch. For instance, a number of classes starting gear is different in the west, with the original gear only being accessible later on. As well as that, Amazon has redesigned various characters so they resemble other ethnicities. Sensor Gaming will be sure to keep an eye on the game and may also make a video that further looks into the different changes that have been made to the western version. What are your thoughts on Lost Ark's western release? As always, let us know your thoughts in the comments below and until next time, thank you for watching. I want to give a big thanks to Mikey X for tipping the channel on its coffee page, as well as to BLS who has also sent a much appreciated tip via coffee. I've now added you guys to the credits for at least the next month, and if anyone else wants to be added next time as well, please see the links in the description for how to support. 